Hey everybody, I'm in Dunmore, Pennsylvania again. I was here last year for the Great Northeast Model Train Show put on by Bernie's Train Shop. So uh, let's go in. There actually might be some more other YouTubers in there, but uh, let's go in and see if I can find some goodies. All right, everybody, it's noisy here. We'll give you an overview of the size of the show. All sorts of good stuff here. Books, scales. They even have a uh, bunch of European trains. Tons of HO buildings. All kinds of parts. But I found a Sparky 107 107. But I don't think he's for sale. Uh, he might be, I don't know. I'll have to ask. You know what's funny is I always come here thinking, eh, there's not much I'm looking for. Got a whole bag of stuff. So I'll show you all the goodies I uh, picked up. All right, what I didn't find at the train show was metal wheels, because I like to use those to upgrade cars. So I was close to Dave's train shop here. We were here back in June, so let's go in and see if I can get some metal wheels and maybe some other goodies. Hey guys, I stopped by Nicholson, Pennsylvania to see the Tuckhannock Viaduct. Love this bridge. And maybe we'll get lucky a train will go over, but don't hold your breath. But while I'm here at the uh, little pull-off, let me show you what I got the train show. All right, first off, I got these two Concor building kits. One's like an old box car, one's an old caboose, but they're like uh, yard office, and this is like an engine crew shanty. Two more road railers, the CNN. They're different numbers. I got a nickel plate Stuart Hobby open hopper, you know, coal hopper. I've been wanting one of these little babies. It's the uh, EMD, what do they call this thing? It's like a yard goat, I think. It's got DCC in it, so it'll be interesting how that runs. And I got this uh, Lima car. I just like the containers. It says Lone Brow, I think, on them. It was cheap. I'll just upgrade the wheels and coupler. So that was my little haul to show. Let's see what I got uh, Dave's train shop. All right, real quick, I'll show what I got at Dave's train shop. This is cool. It's a grab iron template. It's a little metal plate. And it helps you uh, drill holes in cars to put new grab irons on. And I took the thing off so you can see it better, but it's like it was like $4. Not bad for a little template. I got some more uh, Katie Blacken 33-inch wheels. I use those in older cars, like the Stuart car that I got the train show. I got a few packs of the uh, Walters 33-inch wheel sets. Those are all metal. They're heavy. That's why I love using on uh, Cars Upgrade. And then I found this little gem. It's the Woodland Scenics Toy and Hobby Junction building. And I'll hook it up to a battery, and we can see what it looks like lit up. All right, everybody. Sorry if this is shaky. I'm hand-holding this, and uh, going to try to peek in the windows for you. See the sign on the window 
staircase, items in there, parts on the wall. Upstairs, I got hanging airplanes. There's one. I think there's two, maybe. Oh, there's another one. Uh, sorry for the glare. But, uh, you know, they do a fantastic job, Woodland Scenics. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. And as always, raise your train. You might see me. You know, after I shot the video of the building lit up, and then put it back in its package, I actually looked at the car that was attached to it. And this shows you much better what the interior looks like. And by my thumb right there, there's a little train layout up in the second floor. There's the counter and everything. So, all right. For the second time, thanks for watching.